Hello and welcome. This is Today in the News. Here are the highlights. Federal government shots federal government college in Kuali over security threat. Gunmen attack police division in Ondo, kill policemen. Terrorists release three more Kaduna train victims. Police confirm abduction of businessmen in Sakuto. The Federal Minister of Education has ordered the immediate closure of one of its colleges, the Federal Government College Kuali in Abuja. The Minister of Education, Lamo Adamo, who gave the directive in the early hours of Monday, said the closure became necessary following the security breach in Sheda and Lambata villages, suburbs of Kuali Area Council, which also threatened Federal Government College Kuali. According to the minister, the timely intervention of security agencies saved the situation. Mr. Adamo also directed that arrangements should be made for final year students to conclude the NECO examinations. The minister has also directed principals of unity colleges across the country to liaise with security agencies within their jurisdictions in order to forestall any security breach in schools. Gunmen have attacked Kutai Lirinla Police Division, the Yondo State Capital. A police officer was shot dead during heavy shootings. The police authorities have now confirmed the incident. Spokesperson of the command for Malayo Dunlami confirmed the incident. She said investigation has commenced into the attack. Additional three passengers of the Kaduna bound train that was attacked in March have regained freedom. The passengers of the ill-fitted train were abducted by terrorists about four months ago in Kaduna. The released victims, who consist of two males and a female, secured their freedom around 11 a.m. on Monday. They were freed 24 hours after terrorists released a disturbing video where the victims were seen being flogged. TVC News gathered that the released passengers, a female and two males, have reunited with their family members. The Sakuto State Police Command has confirmed the abduction of a businessman by suspected marauding bandits in Tambua, headquarters of Tambua local government area of Sakuto State. The Director of Communications for, for Sakuto Catholic Diocese, Reverend Father Chris Omotosho, reviewed this to newsmen in Sakuto. He said the victim, Tony Udumezu, worshipped with the Catholic Church in Tambua Town. According to Reverend Father Omotosho, the victim was abducted in the early hours of Monday from his residence. He said family members and relations of the victim contacted the police without response before, during and after the kidnapping.